All right, so we got two classically trained strikers here. Any chance this fight actually goes to the ground? This fight does not go to the ground. This one will be fought in the pocket. Two guys will stand in front of each other. They will trade punches. They will trade kicks. It's going to be a classic matchup that you normally see inside of a ring. We get it in the octagon tonight. Great punch landed with so much power. Visibly limping here. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Way to hide that leg kick. Oh, good kicks. Right hand on point. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Oh, and another leg kick lands flush. And now you're starting to see visible damage on that lead leg of his opponent. Visible damage. And you see him starting to make mistakes now in his defenses because his leg is so beat up. It's red. It's all beat up. He's limping. He's turning away. There are so many things that he is doing wrong now because of the leg damage he has taken. My goodness. Huge shots there. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Another leg kick lands. Ooh, what a punch. So just over 20 total strikes have now landed for John Dodson. Just over two minutes, round one. Comes through with a big knee. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Not only will this affect his ability to stand, but he can't really set down on his punches and he won't generate the power that he normally generates because he's getting heavy on his legs. And he landed the right hand there. And now he goes with the combination of punches to the head. Potentially some concussive damage there. I mean, absolutely concussive damage. Landing all those strikes to the head. He's very accurate, he's very fast, and he has a real confidence every time he throws his punches. Oh, beautifully placed in time kick there by Dodson. Beautiful straight punch there. His boxing fundamentals are just so clean. Oh, he looks so sharp tonight. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Well, defense doesn't necessarily win championships in MMA. He's not allowing his opponent to entertain scraps so far. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. Jump that round. Okay, round two, you ready? You ready? Let's All go, right, fight. round two. Kick to the body by John Dodson. Oh, how about this kicking game on full display tonight? Kicks back to back, just truly mixing up the target. Oh, sight to behold. Oh! Use your defense. Use your defense now. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Big kick lands. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Dodds. Over and over, he's fighting behind these beautiful leg kicks. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, Give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook. That's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man. Let this guy have the whole thing. Stay strong. You're still in this fight. Let's go. Come on now. Head kick lands. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, big, big right hook, but a win. So a much 
Just in order to approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one. Turn. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Good sequence of kicks there by John Dodson. Well, he works hard to get up again here, but he looks hurt. Look at the angle of that nice body. They continue to exchange. Oh, and that one snapped the head back. The referee has seen enough. Mercifully, Winner by TKO. He mercifully stopped the fight. A great stoppage and a great performance by this young man. So a big win for him here tonight. And a Let's go, guys. Right, so what has become seemingly an annual stop for the MMA leader, Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. We are back inside Gionesi Arena here tonight, and you can expect these Brazilians to be early, to be loud, and to get behind their fighters as usual. Every time, I mean, they're loud. They're behind their guys. They almost propel the Brazilian fighters to some of their greatest accomplishments, to some of their best performances to date. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. A little cut below that left eye. Oh, you can hear the thwack from here as he lands another leg kick in DC. Now we're seeing visible damage as that leg starts to redden up. And now you start to see the damage. And now you start to see the limping of the opponent. Watch as he gets kicked in the leg, he's turning away. He can't even get any pressure on his front leg anymore. He is beat up. That leg has been tenderized by this young man. Beautiful leg kick thrown. Another big leg kick lands. Two minutes have gone by here, round one. Big leg kick land. Over and over, he's fighting behind these beautiful leg kicks. Nice punch lands over the top. Good series of strikes here on their staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Well, he's up, but he is hurting for certain. The finish could come at any time. Leg kick. Big head kick land. Wow, land another leg kick. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. That'll do it! He got him! What a fight! Well, it's not every day in the UFC that you see a fight ended due to a leg kick, but that one was absolutely devastating. He took away that lead leg of his opponent, who became a one-legged fighter, and then it became just a matter of time. So somewhat anticlimactic here tonight, but not for the winner, as he gets one of the bigger TKO wins of his UFC career. So a massive TKO. All right, crowd getting excited as this fight gets underway, and you hate to call any fighter on this UFC roster a specialist, but on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true five-tool play. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of him. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. Well, the leg kicks have been a big storyline in this one, and there's another one. So he continues to slow his opponent down, and nice poker face on the other side. I'm not sure how many more he can take. He won't be able to take many more. Think about Edson Barbosa, how he lands those beautiful leg kicks, no wind-up so fast. Eventually, guys get stopped from taking too many. This seems to be the path that he is wanting to take tonight in this fight. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh, boy, what a shot. Nice. 
Nice leg kick. He's determined to land as many leg kicks as he can in this fight. Beautiful body kick. Two minutes have expired in our opening round. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Over and over, he's fighting behind these beautiful leg kicks. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Beautiful leg kick thrown. He's really working over that lead leg with those beautiful leg kicks. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is kicking everywhere tonight. He's doing a fantastic job. Nice leg kick lands. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. And every one of them are landing. He's overwhelming him with different attacks. Look at him top of the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Well, he's up, but he is hurting for certain. The finish could come at any time. Oh! He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Oh, he is up, but man, is he hurt. A finish could come here at any time. Hard shots landing on both sides here. That's it. Oh, my God. What a performance! Well, it's not every day in the UFC that you see a fight ended due to a leg kick, but that one was absolutely devastating. He took away that lead leg of his opponent, who became a one-legged fighter, and then it became just a matter of time. So, somewhat anticlimactic here tonight, but not for the winner, as he gets one of the bigger TKO wins of his UFC career.